all stars. Rocky and I are back to read another story. Our story today is called The Very Quiet Cricket by Eric Carle. One warm day from a tiny egg, a little cricket was born. Welcome, chir chirped a big cricket, rubbing its wings together. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened. Not a sound. Good morning, whizzed a locust, spinning through the air. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened. Not a sound. Hello, whispered a praying mantis, scraping its huge front legs together. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened. Not a sound. Good day, crunched a worm, munching its way out of an apple. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened. Not a sound. Hi, bubbled a spittlebug, slurping in a sea of froth. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. What do you think happened? Did he make a sound this time? Let's see. Ah, oh, but nothing happened. Not a sound. Good afternoon, screeched a cicada, clinging to a branch of a tree. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened. Not a sound. How are you, hummed a bumblebee, flying from flower to flower. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened. Not a sound. Good evening, word a dragonfly, gliding above the water. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened. Not a sound. Good night, buzzed the mosquitoes, dancing among the stars. The little cricket wanted to answer, so he rubbed his wings together. But nothing happened, not a sound. A luna moth sailed quietly through the night, and the cricket enjoyed the stillness. As the lunar moth disappeared silently into the distance, the cricket saw another cricket. She, too, was a very quiet cricket. Then he rubbed his wings together one more time. And this time... He chirped the most beautiful sound she had ever heard. The end. Thank you for reading with me. Have a great day.